It's a game break. Ernie Johnson in Atlanta. Uh, man, let's hope game two is something like game one because that was tremendous as we get ready to watch Zion Williamson and the Pelicans. Also known as Russia. That's me and Shaq. We have a kid. That's what they look like. They're taking on the Sacramento Kings. There is the Aaron Fox who's giving child. them about 30 a night. That's our love, child. <laughs> <laughs> Please, we can do without the imagery. Uh, welcome back to Studio J, everybody. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jet Smith, and Charles Barkley. Hey, this was to see that kind of emotion early December regular season game, man, and Indiana was just going crazy tonight over this one. But, you know, this is what, for a young team, this is what the end season tournament's for. All right. If you're a young team, you get an opportunity to, you know, simulate what a playoff atmosphere would look like. You know, Hallibert has never been in that situation, never been part of it. So there's, it's a simulation. Like, they're, they're there trying to figure it out and hopefully could carry that momentum. But one thing that I think that I've learned, you know, as, when, as a player when, back in yesteryear, that when you play at this level, let's say, in the playoffs, there's a level that you play at the playoffs, you realize that the regular season, most people don't play at that level. And, you, and how can you sustain that level of excellence? So for them, it's kind of learning what levels of excellence are to take the next step to maybe win a first-round series instead of just being in a first-round series. They are on their way to Las Vegas, and let's look at the highlights of this one. It was a dandy. It was a heck of a At game. the field house. So my favorite player. Our pregame guest, Tyrese Halliburton. My favorite player right now. Jason Tatum getting ready to go. Oh, the first knockout game, and there is Jalen Brown. Oh, no, has he? takes us. Boston would lead 24-22 after one as you see this continuing first quarter action with Miles Turner. And they got a lot of good players in Indiana. Chuck, this is a game where you say they missed Porzingis, right? Yeah, they definitely missed. There's another 19 point yeah. score. Yeah, no question. It would be hard, too hard for them. Yeah, to yeah, yeah. Jason and, Tatum. And, and also his size. Right. Tatum, 12 at the half, would finish with 32, 12, oh, and a six. Goodness. Give it to him! 4-3. But Halliburton, just a seven-point first half, but he would Ooh. be cooking in the second half. There's Tatum again. Right there. Boston, 55-48 at the break. Halliburton. Oh, hey, 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 I'm not over on. there. I'm over here. Man, my goodness. That's nothing you can do when guys are making those. No, when they like, turn, you turn the wrong way on defense. Oh, and one. Make a turn. Jalen Brown with the bump from Obi Toppin. Who's been a really nice pickup for the Pacers. Mm. Halliburton again on, switching man. hands. This dude is real. Oh, there you go. And Miles Turner, and it rolls for it. Too little down there, Miles. Miles Turner, Obi Toppin having great years for Indiana. Oh, okay. hate him. Too little. 71 apiece. Oh, go get that back, though. Yeah, gets it. Floats, it. floats it back in. And then Halliburton again, mm. weaving his way to the rim. What a hell of a second half, Ernie. Oh, Ernie. Yeah. First Stop. career triple-double for Tyrese Halliburton. Off the block shot, buddy. Heel. They have everybody on that team. They, got, they don't even have a green light. They got, like, a purple light. Yeah, it's called a freeway. Yeah. Indiana Get on led by way. seven after three. Uh, ben ben Audubon. Matherin. Matherin had 16. <laughs> Horford with the kick out. Jalen Brown. Game tied at 94. What's the answer? Oh, go by. You're, you're the stats with a oh. dance, 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 dance. Distinctive three-point form. Is that Chuck Buford? That's Tatum. 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 We are tied at 105. Mm. And then a 9 nothing run. How about a four-point play for Tyrese Halliburton? We're following a jump shooter. That's how don't follow, yeah, don't follow a set shooter either. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> that's what you heard. Buddy healed that's for right. three. Got him. <laughs> don't follow a set shooter. <laughs> that's a good one. Uh, oh, right. Aaron Neesmith. How about Aaron oh, Neesmith? Yeah, his energy was fantastic tonight. He had 11 in the fourth quarter, finished with 14, and the Indiana Pacers knock out the Boston Celtics. So the Pacers move on to Las Vegas where they will meet either the New York Knicks or the Milwaukee Bucks, who will play tomorrow night right here on TNT. But that was, that that was, was a great game, game you, man. You know, Ernie, Kenny was talking earlier. 
this game to me was they were it's, it's like they were so excited to be on national television. That's what it felt like to me because we don't show the Pacers. You know, we interviewed Mr. Halliburton before the game. He's a terrific player, but the energy level you could just like we get a chance to show people that we got a really good team because we don't. Uh, this is the first time we've ever come close to showing the Pacers. Yeah. When you when Kenny talk about being a young team, when them young teams, when young players go against stars, or they get a national television game. It's a big deal. That's and, what I thought happened tonight. Yeah, and part of this whole thing, part of this in-season tournament is, look, this Monday and Tuesday and Thursday, the stage is yours. Mm -hmm. Nobody else in the league is playing. Just oh, those four right. teams oh, wow. tonight, those four teams mm -hmm. tomorrow, and then we get the semifinals on Thursday. And as I said earlier, when you lead the league in scoring, we know you can score. So, you know, talk about their lack of Good job, defense. Captain Obvious. Their lack there of defense, I've said that, and I know this from fact, if you have timely stops, you always have a chance to win. So, you know, it was tied at 105. They went on that 9-0 run. How you go on a 9-0 run? You get stops. So if they can get stops, if timely stops, they definitely have a chance, especially, you know, as, as deadly as they are they, offensively. They, they outscored them 74 to 57 I would know in that the second half chuck. after scoring just 48 in the first half, the right. Indiana Pacers. Congratulations, Indiana. That is congratulations. They love their hoops in that state. Oh, yeah. And uh, they loved it tonight. Get that out to Gene Cady, one yeah. of the best to ever do it. Yeah. Ginobili! It's been a while since we got one of those from you, Chuckster. Hey, Makula Kabunga, relax. It's a regular season game, boy. The is going to be there then. They, they missed Porzingis tonight. Relax. Oh, stop. If they the don't win the championship, do you'll look back to this night Zingas when they were knocked out of the in-season tournament. And Chuck made the prediction. The Pels and the Kings coming your way next.